As we all know, the four great Chinese inventions, printing, the compass, papermaking, and gunpowder were one of the most significant technological advancements of ancient times. However, things have begun to change recently. A new trend in convenience and efficiency is being led by the major innovations of contemporary China which are altering the lives of Chinese citizens. Even though the technology behind these breakthroughs did not begin in China and was originally developed decades ago, China has crossed other countries in terms of widespread adoption and application of almost all technologies in question. By introducing these innovative inventions that we are going to discuss in this video, China is establishing its leadership position in the industrial and technological revolution. Foreign visitors discover that these innovative inventions are prevalent throughout the country. So what are these innovations? Let's find out. Number 1. World's Largest Single-Dish Radio Telescope in recent years, China has become a major participant in space exploration after keeping pace with the United States and Russia. According to a press release, the 500-meter aperture spherical radio telescope, FAST, the world's biggest single-dish radio telescope, was constructed in Gizhou, southwest China, in 2016. The gigantic equipment is intended to keep a close eye on the universe in search of evidence of extraterrestrial life. Since April 2019, Chinese scientists have been able to operate the FAST device, and on September 24, it succeeded a series of evaluations, allowing astronomers from all around the world to use it. Number 2. Invention and Innovation – Bike Sharing Bike sharing systems have been in existence for decades in European cities, but China has made huge improvements in terms of altering how people access bicycles and other modes of transportation. Sharing bicycles in China is therefore the most convenient way and extensively available on the planet. The notion of shared bikes is evolving rapidly and is becoming increasingly popular around the world. The use of shared bicycles in China has the potential to completely transform the feel and appearance of a city. China is an outstanding inventor with the potential to have a significant impact on the rest of the globe. Chinese shared bicycles have made their way into international markets where they have been dubbed a Chinese innovation. Up till today, around 23 million bicycles have been introduced in China, with more than 400 million registered users of these vehicles. To unlock a shared bike, you must use a smartphone app to scan a QR code located on the bike's frame. For example, you are staying near a subway station, but you are anxious to walk there because it is too far away from your hotel. Make sure you have your mobile phone with you, and once you discover a yellow bike, scan the QR code and you're good to go. Cycling through ancient lanes and streets is a popular activity. By riding a bicycle, you can take in the landscape all along the road and get a glimpse of the real Chinese way of life. Number 3. Largest Floating Solar Power Plant As per United Nations-backed research, China is the world's leading investor in renewable power dedicating $698 billion in renewable power generation between 2010 and 2021, which is why it is also the location of the world's biggest floating solar power plant, which is situated in a former coal mining region in the eastern province of Anhui and is the world's largest of its kind. The solar power plant, which was built by Sungro Power Supply, began operating legally back in June 2017 and has the capacity to produce 40 megawatts of energy, which is enough to provide power in 15,000 houses. However, it is possible that it may be surpassed in the near future. Three Gorges Corporation, a competitor developer, has already partly linked a 150 megawatt floating solar project, which is also located in Anhui and will be the world's biggest when completely operational. Number 4. Alipay, China's version of PayPal. Alipay is a payment app that offers many practical and convenient features, and it was the world's first third-party payment platform. Alipay is said to reach 2.5 billion active users by 2025 as claimed by the company. Most shops and even some small stalls in China accept Alipay as a method of payment and consumers can use this method to pay their bills. People no longer need to bring purses or wallets with them when they go out. A cell phone is all you need to take care of everything. People can now utilize digital money in place of cash, and since there is no longer a need for currency, ATM have become obsolete in many areas. 
money transfers, user-friendliness of Alipay in addition to offering a payment facility, savings, and other basic functions. Users could now use this app to pay their debts and utility bills, purchase train or bus tickets, shop on the internet, and reserve a hotel room. Money management, hundreds of lifestyle services, such as consumption discounts and credit accumulation, are available through a voice-controlled AI. With Alipay, there are a plethora of payment options available. Quick payment refers to the collaboration between payment institutions and banks to create a payment system that is efficient, safe, and dedicated. Taking a taxi, purchasing a bottle of water, and even purchasing electricity and gas may all be achieved through the use of a cell phone in the society. Even though websites such as Amazon and eBay have been there for many years outside of China, the Chinese are now engaging in online shopping themselves. Chinese consumers who enjoy shopping online are becoming compulsive shoppers. The Alibaba Group and its subsidiary Taobao in China, founded by Jack Ma, were the world's first online shopping platforms, ushering in an era of electronic commerce. Thus, mobile payment systems have facilitated the growth of online purchasing. When traveling in China, you no longer have to be concerned about how much cash to bring with you. You may pay your bills everywhere, from high-end eateries to wet markets and street vendors, by just showing your QR code. Number 5. First Forest City China is set to begin construction of the world's first forest city in the near future, further enhancing its commitment to the environment. The lush urban area in the region of Wangxi, which will house 30,000 people, will be home to 40,000 trees each of which will be responsible for absorbing 10,000 tons of carbon dioxide every year. Every properties will be surrounded with plants and geothermal energy, and solar panels will be used to regulate the temperature in residences. There will also be a rapid train line, as well as highways for electric vehicles. Construction on the project, which was approved by the Urban Planning Bureau of Liazhu Municipality, is anticipated to begin early next year. Number 6. The high-speed rail system in China, the steel that connects the country. In order to transport 1.4 billion people across China's vast landmass, the Chinese developed a vehicle that was both swift and highly efficient. Chinese railways cover around 25,000 kilometers, with the world's largest high-speed rail network being the most prominent among them. What is it about China's high-speed rail system that is so appealing? High-speed railways commonly known as bullet trains, are specifically constructed for high-speed transportation of residents across the country. The government of China is making it faster, more reliable, and more extensive. China's high-speed rail system connects most of the country's major cities. It is quite useful for passengers to be able to move rapidly between different destinations. Chinese high-speed trains not only go at a rapid pace, but they are also extremely stable. When a high-speed train accelerates, the coin on a table remains perfectly still, according to reports widely circulated on the internet. A number of modern technologies, outstanding services, and cost-effective advantages are available in Chinese high-speed rail. When traveling, transportation is just as crucial as finding a place to stay. Trains that travel at high speeds provide a more comfortable environment while also taking less time to travel. Travelers can sample a variety of regional foods and specialties on board high-speed trains. For example, a train going to Shenzhen will have Cantonese cuisine as a meal option. Prior to boarding the train, you can even order lunch from a nearby restaurant. In different countries, the standards for high-speed rail are set at different levels. Chinese high-speed rail is defined as a design that allows trains to travel at speeds of more than 250 km per hour. According to the National Development and Reform Commission's definition, high-speed trains are those that travel on the rails at speeds of more than 200 km per hour. So what are your thoughts on the rapid development and the new inventions of China? Let us know down in the comment section below. Thanks for watching everybody and just before you go, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. With that said, take care and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.